example 14. Solve the right triangle ABC. If A is equal to 29.43 cm and C is 53.58 cm. Na unsao na ni karun. We write our solution. I ah, know, sorry. We write our given. A is 29.43 cm. B is equal to 53.58 cm. Ah, no, sorry, cc. Okay. So, if we want to know B, we can actually use the Pythagorean theorem. So, atong gamitan ng Pythagorean theorem to find B. A squared plus B squared is equal to C squared. B squared is unknown. So, B C squared minus A squared. C squared is 53. 53.58 squared minus A is... 29.43 squared. B squared is equal to 53.58 squared minus 29.43 squared and that is 2,004.696915. Six, Take the square root of both sides. So B is equal to 44, 44.7738139 cm. So this is our letter B. Side B. So actually, next for our angle, we are given a lot of options as to how are we going to solve for our angle. So we can use sine, we can use cosine, we can also use tangent to find any of the angle. So, decide lang mo mga guys kung asang inyo hanggamiton. Okay? But you just go back to the definitions of the three trigonometric functions. When I say three, katong sine, cosine, tangent. Ngano ang di ba ako ningon nga six? Okay, again, for our calculators, we don't have functions for the other three. Si second, cos, second, o si cotangent. Only sine, cosine, tangent. So, mauna siya nga ang katurang three. Sine, cosine, and tangent. So, for our sign, you decide kung letter is A bang unahon or letter B. But of course, since na may box 3, we can say that C is equal to 90 degrees. Okay, for letter A, let us solve for letter A. For A. For A, let us use tangent for example. Tangent A is equal to tangent is opposite over adjacent. What is opposite to angle A? That is 29.43, right? Which is letter A. And what is adjacent to A? And that is letter B, which is 44.7737 then A is equal to inverse tangent aninia. Isulat na siya dala mga guys ha. Then A is equal to, so that's 29.43 divided by 44.7737-8139 and you will get 0 0.6573043321. Shift tangent, so we have tangent to the power of negative 1, then press answer, and you will get 
1.44 in decimal degree. So, pwede ra kayo. Ngayon yung answer is in decimal degrees. Now, like I said, dagang tagpamaagi sa pag-solve sa angle A. So, let us exhaust all of those options, no? So, if we can solve it via tangent, we can actually actually solve it via sine. Sine A is equal to, on sa may side, sine is opposite over hypotenuse. Ang side opposite to angle A is 29.43 divided by the hypotenuse which is 53.58. Then A is equal to the inverse sine of 29.43 over 53.58. So our A is equal to 29.43 divided by 53.58 and then inverse a shift sign answer and still 33.31709144 degrees. So pwede kayo nga sign po. So, and lastly, that is in terms of cosine pod. Cosine A is equal to adjacent mani si cosine adjacent over hypotenuse. So, ang adjacent side niya would be letter B. And ang value for letter B is, I mean, small letter B is 44.77378139 divided by 53.58 A is equal to inverse cosine of isulat na siya mga guys ha wala na ako isulat kay Gitapol <laughs> sorry pero kung sa inyong solution during our future exam this coming January isulat yun okay 44.77 37 eh 8139 divided by 53.58 and then inverse cosine answer is still 33.31709144 degrees. So, daghan. Now, for letter B, pwede po nga sine B, cosine B, I mean, what's the cosine B? Pwede nga cosine bet B, sine B, or tangent B. Parihan yung gihima na ito. Or pwede po nga A plus B plus, 9, ah, plus C is equal to 180 degrees and find B. Since nakuha naman na ito si A and, nakuha, and kabalumanta nga si C is 90 degrees, then we can calculate for our B. And pwede po unahon ninyo si B, usapan nyo po isolve si A. So, kamari bahala mga guys. So, that is example 14. Solving the right triangle. So, next would be we'll have more applications of right triangles.